song in the mail is gone. Uh, Till I got smell cologne. Yeah, I just had to deal with them all. Yeah, yeah. I do what I want. Good, good. Play if you want the store. Prezi, I'm Obama, hey. I condone the drama, hey. I told him I'm Madonna, hey. Do you need pajamas, yeah? Stay in the night, girl, you promised it. I hide in the cave like Osama did. I'm throwing them back in the diamond district. Do you need me like dollars that I roll to you? Yeah, money and me are the same, but I just don't fall for you. Yeah, run me your body, I put a range on the road for you. I don't know what you were told, but I ain't mad. I sent you out me to a beat, boy, you crazy Diamond in the rough, you look as good as Oprah's breakfast I just wanna 
wanna take you out Fuck you and your mama house Overseas I fly you out Is he tricking? Do she really love me? Let's just find it out Baby, what's up with your mouth? City girls straight from the south Is he tricking? Do she really love me? Let's just find it out Baby, what's up with your mouth? City girls straight from the south One of the main things that I liked about this hair when I first took it out was the color. I did obviously like the color job that they did. I feel like it was a nice blonde. On camera, it looks like a true blonde, but in person, it's more like a honey blonde. It's not like that super bright blonde, so I think it is more wearable for like my skin tone or deep, you know, deeper complexion. Also, I think they did a pretty good job, you know, bleaching the hair, doing the roots and everything all the way around. There are places like this that I wish that were more consistent you know like maybe bring the bleach up a little bit more and then of course you guys saw that I did correct my um, part because I was having issues when I bleached it obviously I over bleached it but I was able to correct that and I did show you guys how to do so so if you ever have a unit that has over bleached roots um, in your part it's very quick and easy to correct it um, I use this temporary hairspray in the color dark brown I do like this but I feel like it runs a little bit so you just have to be really careful with this and it's a temporary dye so if it gets on your lace or on your hair or anything like that, literally you can wash it out and it'll be 
out the same day. It's not like a permanent spray or nothing like that. When I first took the wig out of the packaging, the hair was extremely soft, still is extremely soft, especially for this to have been bleached. Obviously they bleached his hair to get it to this color and the hair is very soft. Like, I don't know what they did to it, girl. I feel like they put fabric softener or something. I don't know, child, but it's like super, super soft. So I do like that about the hair and the fact that it's not like blonde hair shedding all over the place, you know, because usually when you have this type of look, that is something that you have to look for. That's something you have to worry about, about the hair shedding. Anytime you process hair, that is a possibility. But I haven't received much shedding with this unit. The only downside that I have with this unit is just that it's too thin. Like this is it for this side. Like this is how much hair is over here. And then for this side, like it's just really, really thin, you know, for me and my liking. I definitely would have preferred this unit to be a little bit fuller. So if you do decide to order this unit, I would definitely say go up in the density, maybe get 180% density, or maybe even a 200% density if they have it available. But I'm assuming this is 130. They might advertise it as 150, I'm not sure, but for me just looking at it and being somebody that deals with hair on a daily basis this is giving me 130 percent density it's very thin which is why i did go ahead and pull this side back because i mean i could pull this forward you see how thin it is like you can see through you know and i don't really like that so i don't know the back is a lot more full than the front but i feel like even the color job is done better on this side than it is on this side. You see how this side is? Like it looks like splats, you know, versus this side. So that's another reason why I feel like this side may look better, you know, just being combed back and put behind my ear. And then the last issue that I was having, there's a piece of, uh, I guess the tracks, the fabric, I don't know, that like that's bunching up right here. Maybe it's from the adjustable strap, but if that was the case, then it should be happening over here too. And I don't really have it like that over here, but over here, like when I'm combing my hair back, you see how they have like this piece that like won't, I don't know, you guys can barely tell. You would have to touch my hair to see what I'm talking about. You know, there is that issue. But all in all, this is what the unit is looking like. So if you guys are interested in this unit, I will have a link for you down below. Let me know how you guys like me in this blonde hair. I don't know, I don't really wear blonde hair like that, but if y'all like it, I love it. So let me know if y'all feeling me in the blonde. Uh, would you wear this unit? Go ahead and leave a comment down below letting me know what your thoughts are on today's wig. Thank you guys so much for watching today's video and I'll see y'all you guys in my next one. Bye!